<laughs> yes. Greetings, greetings, everyone, and welcome to a Tuesday afternoon live stream. I'm switching things up today. Um, uh, ten minutes from preacher opening volley. Um, are we orking around or working with the humans? Um, horde side, but I'm a panda. I've actually never made an orc character. Orcs are trolls. They just don't appeal to me. All the teeth. Nope. Um, uh, I hope everybody's doing good this fine Tuesday afternoon. Uh, I'm kind of changing things up a bit because I want to. Uh, we will, uh, I'm just kind of winging it. I'm going on the advice of Mr. Dark Preacher, and I'm doing what makes me happy. And, uh, everybody else is just along with the ride. So, yeah. Um, it's not Bit Wars with 10 bits. We'll see if anybody else retaliates. So, we, uh, get your giant thing out of the way. Thank you. Um, I've been messing with the Battle for Azeroth, the new expansion. Thank God. Uh, so, I'm actually gonna... Walk my panda butt out here. Let's break out the big turtle. I like my turtle. These are the racial mounts for pandas. They're adorable. Mine is a big nose ring. It's purple. I'm gonna do a fly around here real quick. What is your business here? I want to go down there, please. Yeah. So this is Andalar. This is actually the port city you come to. After doing the opening sequences to kind of get the mod, pa uh, the new pack started, the new expansion pack started. Um, uh, it is, there's a really interesting sequence of events you have to go through in a series of quests to kind of connect the old world to this new world. And it's really interesting. But you come to this kind of jungle embedded city of Zandalar. Um, I'm sorry, the continent is called Zandalar. This is Zoldazar. If that's not confusing and enough Z's for you, I don't know what is. But it is a gorgeous city. They did an amazing job at doing city design and generally laying it out. All sorts of crazy stuff. And it is really awesome. I see no wings on that orc. Now the orc has wings. You're a bit lost, Night Pirate. Um... So yeah, you come down to the port. Isn't an orc with wings a gargoyle? I was going to say. But, you know, whatever. Um, let's pull the turtle out. I do like my turtle. Um, dun -dun 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 -dun. All terrain. Good swimmer. No downsides. Come into these docks right here. Now, I do have other characters that I could probably start. I think I have one character I could start the expansion off with. But what the heck is that? Is that? It looks like a goblin boat. Okay, weird. Um, you start down here, and uh, I could start it off on a new character, on another character, but as it stands right now, I'm uh, a little worried that if I did that, um, the videos might get claimed by Blizzard on YouTube. I don't know. I'm not sure I care about such things anymore, really, but... Um, I've just barely started with this character, did some of the opening cinematics, and I figured we could kind of start running into the jungle and doing some stuff. Uh, what is, there's a trainer over here? Oh no, this is Nathanos. Okay, yeah. Let's put the turtle away. It's gigantic. Do not test me. Okay, dude. Um, the war campaign. Yeah, here we go. Remember, this is war. We accomplish nothing by simply adding the Zandalari to our ranks. We eventually need to crush the Alliance. So cheerful. Um, you and I will be leading operations in Kul I don't know where that is. Uh, but first, we need resources. Gather 100 war resources. Yeah, a general overall mission to uh, keep things interesting. I don't think... No, that's not usable yet. What's down here? I haven't gone... Bo oh, wow. This is... This is an undead boat, so there's lots of cobwebs, apparently. You guys need to dust. Okay, I gotta remember. I think I am in... Yeah, I'm in... I, I'm in uh, tank mode. I need to go to DPS. Um... dun dun, -dun. Okay, real quick, I gotta straighten something out. I think I already did. 
Um, all of this part of my inventory, notice this thing's a portable refrigerator. That's not a joke. I have a mini fridge that this guy carries around because he's a cook. And pandas in general just get major bonuses from food. So, uh, I'm going to do that one. He eats a lot. It shows in his waistline, too. Uh, character after my own heart. Also, that reminds me, somewhere down here, there was somebody that was selling some really nice premium food stuff. Uh, awesome. It is. I mean, I... The, the, uh, pandas get a racial bonus called, um... Epicurean. Your love of food allows you to receive 100% more of the stat benefits from the well-fed effects, which is that. Instead of getting just 22 points to stamina, I get 44. I get double what everybody else does. So I carry around a lot of food. Not down here. Is it upstairs one level? There was somebody that was actually selling Pandaren picnics. Um, notions from afar. What are you? What's your lucky do? What the heck are you? Okay, weird. Herbs and elixirs from a race I have never seen before. Baha! Baskets! From a panda lady! Um, okay. Black coffee. I actually don't need mana. Uh, one third of me needs mana. Correction. The tank and the DPS down. Um, I am drinking an Arnold Palmer today. Black tea and lemonade. And lemon juice. Because I like tang. Um, uh, nope, don't need it. Yep. Okay, let's see. I cannot put that there. Doesn't count as food. Oh, I'm so let down. Okay, fine. I'll put them here. Farewell. Whatever. You lemonade. I hate sour things. I don't drink lemonade straight. Yeah, a red panda lady at that, Do exactly. Um, I don't drink uh, lemonade straight, not house. generally. We have far more important matters to address. Okay. Greetings. Dockside Get ruffians. By whose authority? Give the words of Zul. Okay, I can do both of those. Uh, another person will appear here later. Doot, doot. So now, I need to go around and uh, spread the word of the Zindalari prophet Zul. Tell people that they're supposed to like us in line spots. This is super awesome. This giant, what is this thing called? A caravan Brutosaurus? Um, uh, you can, Brutosaur, yeah. You can apparently get these as mounts and like have other people ride on them with you. Let's go over here. What you want? Oh, hey, I'm supposed to kill some of you guys. I'm going to talk to your boss first and then I'm going to whoop all the rest of your butts. Hmm. And which lower do you bargain with? Those visions, Ba, did he tell you? About the time he predicted Zandalar would sink beneath the waves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. He was wrong. Oh, there was damage, but Zul fled with our fleet and started a few wars. Those of us who stayed endured, we rebuilt, because that is what it means to be Zandalari. Okay, man. The wife can't comprehend why I don't like sour things. I actually don't like sour things either. Not really. Not super sour. I like tart things. Not sour things. Like, I like kind of vinegary, kind of based um, stuff in it, you know? I like that. Like sauces that have some vinegar ingredient in it. But I can't stand to, like, sour candy or warheads or whatever. And five bits from Dragon Racer. I wanted 100, but Twitch won't cooperate. Yeah, see, the wife, on the other hand, mmm, sour. Um, okay. It is too far away. Yeah, I'm gonna just kind of pick on you. Throw that up. Foot sweep. Kung Fu. Um. I am out of range. Let's see if we can get this guy to cooperate. Also. There we go. Are you 
would do. Oh yeah, I need to do something. I need to target something first. Stuff hits harder, and my gear is a little lower on this dude. Maybe I do need to be in tank mode. Hang on a sec. Let's eat some dried mackerel strips. Mmm, sounds delicious. Who doesn't like dried mackerel? Um, okay, now I'm convinced that Jen and my wife were separated at birth. 100%, man. Hey, Trunks, what's going on? I'm snacking on my panda monk. Um, yeah, I am actually going to go to Brewmaster. Get to throw some beer kegs around and generally be more durable on things. Yes, fish jerky, basically. Dried mackerel strips. Okay, there's some lady over here. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Have some beer. Let's sweep. Have a little bit of drink. A beer keg. Fire on them. Do a little of that. And they're slowly dying off one by one. Drinking all sorts of stuff. My whole stock. There we go. Thugs dead. How many thugs was that? That was four. <laughs> May the Loa bless your gen. But where did you hide it? Yeah, I have a thing called a mini fridge. Literally. Portable fridge. I've got a grilled mini rays. Let's see. Um, -na -na. I need a hand with the most unsavory task. Crimson cultists have made themselves uh, a market for blood magic. This is bad. This is very bad indeed. I need you to go down the steps and bring me back any evidence you can of blood practitioners. Okay. Easy peasy. Um, I'll beat up some thugs in the process, I guess. But yeah, I've got uh, a banquet of the brew. Uh, feed up to 10 people in your raid or party. Restores X amount of health and mana. If you spend at least 10 seconds eating, you'll be well fed and gain 12 plus 12 in a stat, whatever class, whatever primary stat for your class, like agility or intelligence or whatever, for an hour. Or uh, And uh, if you're a panda, you don't get 12, you get 24, because we cheat. Uh, we like eating. Um, twin fish bladders, grilled mini rays, uh, braised turtle soup, um, poached eggs. I've got mackerel jerky, basically. Uh, stuff called fighter chow. This stuff's really awesome. Um, a actually, yeah, I'm going to have some fighter chow. I've got uh, salmon, uh, barracuda, uh, <laughs> uh, farnar fizz. This stuff's fun. Um, pickled storm ray. Yes, who doesn't like pickled rays? Uh, deep fried moss gill. I'm not sure what moss gill is. Uh, salt and pepper shanks. These are awesome. Um, I used to have something called fireball ribs. Can't remember what I did with it. Sauteed carrots, blech. All sorts of fun stuff. Yep, I have now swapped out what I'm, what I'm, uh, you're eating a panda monk. I'm not eating a panda monk. Make myself some dinner house Zandalar treating. Actually, I really like it. The content is very, very well laid out. Like, Okay. One part of the whole thing, I retextured mine. But, um, where is it? There it is. Um, can I? Nope. Okay. Vest of the Champions. And then you have this necklace uh, that is the heart of Azeroth. Basically, as you're leveling up, I've got this little meter right down here that says artifact power. And the necklace will level up and impart to one of your artifacts. Right now, the only one I have is the chest piece. Um, it, it levels it up and you gain specific abilities. I think I have one thing. Sunrise technique, attacking a target with rising sun kick, which is actually on my monk spec. I mean, on my 
uh, DPS spec. Not this one. Causes your damage melee abilities to deal 196 additional physical damage to that target for 15 seconds. So it puts a dot on them. Um, let's see. Yeah, this one is Mistweaver. This one is Windwalker or Mistweaver. Um, when you blackout strike, your stagger is reduced. I would swap it to this one for... And this is just generally an overall. Um, as a matter of fact... Um, eh, anyway, I'll, I'll worry about it here in a second. But you power up this, and then the next thing would, I think, either be helmet or shoulders. Uh, it's basically, they know that you're going to be getting artifact helmets, chest piece, and shoulders. So you get all the other parts. They don't give you useless pieces. When you're getting quest rewards or loot or whatever, you'll get legs, boots, wrists, uh, gloves, um, cloaks, um, everything else you kind of get. Um, when you first get here, you'll get up an upgraded set of shoulders and helmet and a helmet, but that's it. You don't get a whole bunch of other stuff, so you don't really have armor that you end up throwing away. I have been getting some weapons I don't need from quests, but, you know. Um, I really do like it, though. Um, the way you pour down drinks while fighting makes me think of Drunken Master, says Wilpon. This is 100% what the Brewmaster is designed on. Um, uh, Iron Skin Brew... Purifying Brew, I've got um, Healing Elixir, I throw beer kegs at people, basically, that's the whole point, is the Brewmaster, is supposed to be the tank, the Drunken Master, I do that, and then I exhale flame and set the dude on fire, uh, let's spin kick and knock him on his butt, and drink one of these and make myself feel a little bit better, about to say you're about dead man um i think i think that the uh totem the voodoo totem things is down here i think can't remember is it did i go the wrong way i think i went the wrong way it's all right we'll, we'll work our way around um tankard tossing yeah moss skill sounds like a type of catfish you think so I'm not sure. Um, uh, nah, nah. No. Yeah, Deep Raid Mo Moskill, and it's definitely a fish. It's an icon of a fish right there. But beyond that, I don't know. Uh, let's... Let's sweep! You'll see, I'll toss. Whoops, okay. Um, I will toss uh, tanks up in the air, and then I'll start to drink something, and the keg will come down and hit them for a whole bunch of damage. I toss kegs at them directly, all sorts of crazy stuff. I don't know where I get them. I'm, I'm basically carrying a whole bunch of liquor with me. Woo, there goes one, and... Smash! Woo! And there's another one. Dun, dun, dun. That is the Brewmaster. I absolutely love the Brewmaster. He's great. Um, I like the Monk. Because they're a Jack of all trades class, basically. Come over here and get this. I don't really need it there. Woo! Um, monks are very much a kind of a, a, a jack of all trades, master of none. They have a tank mode and they're great tanks, but they're never going to be quite as good as a warrior or a paladin or a, 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 a death knight. Um, they have a, a healer mode, Mistweaver, and Mistweavers are amazing healers and they're on par with druids, but both of those are not really quite up to par. Well, they're close to druids, druids are a little bit better. And uh, those are still not quite up to par as having just a dedicated cleric. Um, uh, they have a DPS mode called the Windwalker, and the Windwalker is amazing, but it's probably never going to be quite the same melee uh, damage as like a rogue or a warrior, maybe. So they can kind of switch around, kind of like a druid can. And I have a druid that's now become quickly become one of my favorite characters, too. Actually, Brewmaster is one of the strongest tanks right now. Is it? I didn't... I, the, where things are in the rankings are one of those things that just I don't always keep up with. 
Uh, let's see. I've got somebody over here. I need to deliver some stern talkings to. Um, also, there's a sand. There's a, a thug over here that I can knock about. Dockside thugs. Eleven and fifteen. Let's toss keg, light him on fire, and knock him down. Whee! Um, I don't really keep track of which ones are better or worse. There's been a lot of class streamlining since I last played, and I like a lot of what they've done in terms of the class streamlining. Oh, that person's up a level. Okay, never mind. Um, what about over here? Oh, hang on a sec. Thugs. Let's see. Aim for the middle one. Have some beer. Have some fire. Oh, whoops. Wrong move. Do that. Do that. Not very complicated. There was a lot of like confusion and rotations, like what abilities you would use. Yeah, get over there. Suck it. That's gonna be coming back down in a minute. Yeah, there it is. I have a lot of staying power. Oh yeah, right. I ran out of things to kill. Um, I, if you get the rotation right. If you get what order you, do, you use your powers in, it's real easy to stay alive with a monk. Real easy. Uh, where is... Ah, here we go. Hello, nice lady. Zol, describe you to me once in perfect detail. You have even that thing on your face, just as he described. Tell me, is it true? Have you brought me his word? Show her the word of Zol. Okay. And then Volcini goes away. That's kind of creepy. Somewhere around here. Let's see. Master of Fate. I don't know what they do. This thing's great. Transmogrifier. This is basically making one piece of outfit look like another. So you can make your outfits match. Uh, this whole set of armor is called Crane Feather Armor. But I'm not wearing Crane Feather Armor. It's other stuff that I've made to look like it. It's really cool. Here we go. Reforge an item. Uh, the wife's in here. Um, I want to do this one, please. Reforge. Five gold. No big deal. And then you can re-roll your powers. I'm not Mist Weaver right now, so it won't work. Overall, or this one. This one is going to be much more valuable to me. I actually run around as tank a lot more anyway, because it's just general. If you get ambushed, you, you've got more survivability. Okay, I finished. Oh, wait a minute. There's quests over here. I'm actually going to come back to those. There's a person upstairs I need to talk to. Let's blow up the turtle. The stagger mechanic combined with the changes to other tanks have made them amazingly strong. They have the smoothest incoming damage curve, so they're easier to heal. Yeah, that's the thing is the stagger mechanic for tanks. Basically, a monk does not take damage. A monk buffers damage. So it comes in and kind of gets lumped into this pool. And this kind of, you know, it's almost like a container, like a jar of damage. And the more that's in the jar, there's a steady tick of damage going to the tank from the jar, to the brewmaster. The more that there is in the jar, the larger each tick is, but it still smooths it out so you don't get these big spikes of damage. It's a kind of a gentle kind of a curve, almost like a sine wave. And they have abilities that mitigate that. I've got like the iron brew, one of the things I drink all the time, or purifying brew. It clears half of the current damage that's in the jar in that buffer. And then I've got another one which increases the overall volume of the jar for seven seconds, which means that the ticks coming out of it get smaller. So there's a lot of little tricks that you can do to smooth out all of those bumps. Yes, there was a quest lady to turn in, but... Um, so yeah, Trunks has a very good point that's something I thought about, but I kind of figured that warriors and paladins and such would have what you want, a greater... Uh, damage mitigation skill than that. Uh, show him the word of Zal. Okay, so beat. 
I heard that. Hello? There's a kind of... Yep, there it is. Oh, okay. It's somebody's pet. It's a hunter's pet. Oh. There's a warp sound, a boo noise every time something goes into stealth. And anytime I hear it, it makes me paranoid. Um, okay. We need to go turn two of these in. Probably get more, and then go deal with the dark uh, fetish people, the the crimson cultists. Hello. I am listening. Hi, Zolani. She's nice. I like her. Okay. Um. Uh, the general has orders to ensure this place had protection, guard protection. I see none of that. The general's a stubborn general, and. Uh, one I have had my eye on for a while now. Regardless, we must remind these lesser tribes who rules the city. I charge you with collecting heads? Talparak and Talaman. Enter Talparak and Talaman and collect a quota of heads. Six Amani heads and six Sand Fury heads. Okay. And there's some gear that I get from it. I have no time for nonsense. Okay, the word of... Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Word of Zell. Um, you are competent errand Pandaren, after all. Perhaps you could be trusted in more important ta ta tasks. I can't talk. Okay, two of these. One of them I can do. That one. This one I cannot, and I'll show you why. It's got something that it wants me to collect. Uh, the tongues of Gazragon. Remember, tongues, plural. Because it's a Hydra. And it requires three people to do. Uh, okay. I'm um, going over here. Nope, 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 nope. Dark fetishes. There we go. Okay, that lady's right there, and I think she meant these stairs. Yes, she did. Okay. Where are you going? Come back. Zendelari are very big on their heads. Yes, head collection. Hello. Have some beer. Clear half the damage. So a foot sweep and knock them on the butt. Beer keg. Clear half the damage. I could do this all day. Let's increase the actual stagger size. Oh yeah. Oh crap, they're on fire, I forgot. There's an ability that pandas get called Quaking Palm. It's a, it's a racial unique... Oh, wait a minute. I need to repair my stuff. Hang on a sec. Whoops. Wrong one. I have a, I have a, a fixer in my pocket here somewhere. There you go. Bow. See, I, I'm no use for bow. Instantly complete construction of... Oh, yeah, right. That's another thing. Uh, we can put the tab. We can put that away. Um... Who was I talking about? Can't remember. I blanked. Yes, they're big on head collection. Anyway. Um, yeah, oh, Quaking Palm. They have a racial ability. <laughs> Hang on. Boop. Tool tip. Cursor anchor. Found that last night. Boop -doo. Where is it? There it is. A oh, paralysis. Incapacitates target for one minute. Limit one. Damage will cancel this effect, right? Then there's another one called Quaking Palm. Strikes the target for a with lightning speed, incapacitates him for four seconds, and turns off your attack. Oh, okay. Somebody is basically aggroing the room. Who is that? Oh, Orc Warrior. Uh, okay. Oh, and they have a Blood Elf Priest with them. A Shadow Priest. A DPS, a DPS Cleric, basically. And the two of them together just cleared out about seven or eight things. Great. The panda's just going to waddle over here for a second. Did that backwards. It's bad. 
I don't like you. You're casting things. Why am I not? There we go. Oh. I'm getting my keys confused. There we go. I'm bumble fingering things. Let's do that. Do that. Knock you off your feet. There we go. Periodically, my brain starts misfiring, and I do shift instead of alt. Still getting used to things. Um. Oh, you brought a friend. How nice. Go over to that. Order in which I do things can actually get me more charges on the potions I use to mitigate my damage, too. Oh, it's dead. And then we do... Look, I'm all better. Uh, oh, hey, guys! What's up? Let's throw some of that down so I can get a drink. Oh, you're back. Oh, hi. Think I have both of these? Yep. Plus, I can pick up some bubbles over here. Um, they drop these things called Chi. Anytime I'm attacking people, you'll see little orbs of energy that pop out. No! Bad caster. Oh, hello. Nope. Good night. Really cool. I, I, there's a lot of really weird stuff you can do with a panda monk over other monks. And I think that was intentional. Um, I'm not saying they're super better. It's just there's different tactics you can use because of some of the ratios they have. Nope. Let's have a drink. Have a drink. Have a drink. <laughs> Oh, crap, see? I set things on fire so much, I kind of forget. I was going to use paralysis there, but... Mm. Whee! Leather! This guy's a leather worker. I need to get closer. Bet you do. Oh, I have all the... things I need from these guys. Uh-oh. This time that. Okay. Aha, here we go. I like lining people up a little bit. No casting. That's bad. Do a little bit of that. Do that. I have a brew that I haven't even busted out yet. But you see these little energy orbs that pop up as I fight? Those are chi orbs that monks generate. As, oh, yeah. As they're fighting stuff, they get chi orbs that they generate. And you step, sidestep and pick them up, and they give you health and energy back. So that's like a survival mechanism. Is there a chest in here? Sometimes there's a chest in here. I don't think there's a chest in here. Ooh. Um, do I need... Okay, I think that's it for that quest. Let's do this. Turbo Turtle, away! Ignoring all of you. Ignoring all of you. Nope. 
Nip, 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 nip. And they're running away. Are they? Yep. Super weird. Um, we got dark fetishes. Blood magic is infectious. It spreads like a disease if not purged. Speak with Zalami, Blade of the King. Um, Jack Rosette refused to patrol this area. Yasma's spies did not warn us of the evil lurking beneath our city. And Zell did not foresee blood magic festering under our noses. These are serious allegations. And the evidence is in your hands. Basically, uh, the whole storyline going on here is that there is a king that's been ruling for hundreds of years. And a Zendalari, troll king. And um, his daughter, we saved because they got abducted by the Alliance. They got basically... Of their oh, one of their boats got intercepted that happened to have the princess on it, and the princess and the head the lead prophet for the king got uh, p imprisoned by the alliance. So we busted them out. That's what we started off our quest line with for this place is busting them out, getting them back here, and settling in in this city called Zeldazar. And the king was like, "Thank you for saving my daughter. Very brave of you. Here we'll give you a building to work out of and operate out of." And uh, we kind of have an, a, a horde embassy here now. Um, which is super awesome. Um, let's mount back up on our turtle. Dun, dun, dun. And uh, it is a situation where... What? Zandala will there we go. Endure. Evidence of evil. Uh, blood magic being practiced in open daylight. This cannot stand. You have done well in bringing me this information. I will present it to King uh, Rastakhan in uh, the first opportunity when the council is away. So, uh, yeah, artifact power. See, the meter goes up and I got plus 100. I need to get another 150 and I'll max the current tier out and I'll open a, unlock another ability on my thing. Um, but the current thing is, is that the king's been ruling for a couple hundred years now. And he's got one general that doesn't like us outsiders interfering with things. He's very power-hungry, typical thing. He's got a prophet, which is saying, you know, you need to listen to the horde. You need to listen. What we have to do is persuade the king that the horde is good, that we are beneficial towards his kingdom, and work from that point. Um, so, yeah. Okay, I got to remember. Oh, right. Somewhere. I am the high priestess of I'm gonna show you show you folks. Yep, over here. Okay. I think it's higher up. I'm going to show you why I cannot do this quest. Let's go one tier up. I have to collect collect heads up here. Skull splitter, sand fury dune red. Hi. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Burn! Ah, ha, ha, ha. There's one head. Here's another person we can pick on. You don't seem to be doing much. Dazem. I, if you get the order right, it's pretty hard to kill a monk. Uh, have some beer. Yes, yeah, I finished the full health. Hello, hello. Hey, Sharpie, what's going on? How are you? Uh, okay, I'm going to go over here. Instead of dealing... No, apparently I'm going to deal with some axe throwers. 
Don't chuck axes at me. That's rude. Have that. And uh, fight. Have a trip to the floor. Um, no. We will keep your axes. I got time. I'm gonna do this. And this. And this. Nope. Fight the panda. Okay, five out of six. Awesome. See that gong? Going to do something incredibly dumb. I'm gonna go ring it. And nope. That's Gazragog. Gazragon. I'm not fighting that thing. Um. It's got a lot of health, and it does uh, actually doesn't have that much health. But it does an amazing amount of damage. I, I basically got almost three or four shot by it. So I think you need some help to kill it quick. It's recommended. I am out um, of rage. It's one of those missions that's kind of recommended. Have a trip to the floor. Um, to have more people help you. Because it hits like a truck. Come back. Oh, whoops. going. Don't run. It's rude. Sand Fury heads. I have too many heads. Um, I don't remember him being elite. He should be killable. Okay. Let's see what happens. I tried to do this as my, uh, I'm actually gonna whoop, safety over here. That's my checkpoint basically. Hello, Hydra. What's going on? Whoops! It's Mads. Let's back up a little bit. Okay, I'm doing far better than I thought I would. No. You see, it'll cover... It has an ability called Regenerative Blood. Also, those uh, poison things do a lot of damage. I don't know if it's for the first head or what. It is... What? But I, when I see that regenerative thing, no. I try to stop it. Because I'm not sure what happens. I think it gets a whole bunch of health back. Poison bomb. Oh, dear God, it's dead. I killed it! Oh, man, I got killed in record time. Where are you going? Thank you. I got killed in record time when I did that in uh, Windwalker mode. It was like... Seven seconds in to the fight. Oh, I'm dead. What happened? So I never went back. Um. Oh, for anybody wondering if you don't play a monk. We can zap back and forth like that. That's what I use for fight checkpoints sometimes so I can escape. I'll put one around the corner. Um. Yeah, so I got... Unraveling cloth cowl. It looks a lot like a fedora. Uh, a wand, a bow. Did I get all the tongues? I think I did. Okay. Uh, now, let's see. I don't need any more sand fury. I think I have to go over here and get some Amani, some heads from different people. I'm a head collector. Yep. Okay. Hello. Nice bear. I'm not sure why you didn't stay on it. Here, have a trip. I'm just going to drink some, if that's okay with you. There we go. Oh. Hi. 
Vile Branch Speaker. I don't know what you are. No. Naughty. I'm gonna have a sip of that. Okay. Um, lightning bolt. Oh, that was a charge. <laughs> okay. Fine. Two can play this game. Whoop, he's dead. Clear out the rest of my stagger. Oh, that's going to get old. Let's say. Oh, God. Okay. Pull the chi in. Drinks. Plunk. You'll see the caskets drop from this guy, and it actually does damage to him. It's great. It is too far away. I should have seen that coming. I mean, honestly. Oh, okay, I'm all good. Um, <laughs> my strip CNX ball <laughs> says Dark Preacher. Exactly. Uh, okay, I need... Oh, why not? Uh, yep, can't charge me if I'm too close. got to be a stagger thing. Hey, um, Air, uh, Trunks, you use LVI, right? The same UI I'm using. Do you know if there's a way to turn on stagger for monks? Like a meter? Yeah, hey, remember these guys charge you. Thank you. Is there? Hang on a sec. Actually, I'm not going to do it in here. I'll get charged and punked. Um, I need to go over here. Somewhere. Okay, I'm just going to park, like, here for a minute. Ah, welcome to the Stealth Man 5000. I absolutely love these things. They're great. As long as you don't move. Nobody can see you. Um, let me see real quick. Hang on a second. I think it is not nameplates. It is what? Unit frames? Unit frames. Player unit frame. Class bar. No. Um... Maybe that's a thing at the top. Spaced or filled. What? Additional power text? I don't know. Combat, rest, portrait, name, power, health. Um, uh, I don't know. Done it. Done it. Boop. See, you move and it breaks it. Um, do I need? I, I do not need your head. Where am I going? There's a dude back here. Um, uh, my disciples defeated. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta go back here and do a fight. I need you closer. 
Person to nice person. Blood Elf Priest. Yep. Bye. That was a panda equivalent of a hit and run. There we go. These are the people I need to fight. Leave them alone. It's a marathon. Oh my God, that's a big bear. Disciple of Nalarak. Holy crap. Okay. Bang that gong. Get I it on. Now. Now I can attack it. Oh, that is. That's my stagger bar across the top. Okay. Let's put Sweep the Bear real quick. Got some beer, got some fire. That was a dude. Okay. This is an a night elf. I'm not sure though. Who is this? Blood Elf. Oh, thank God. If we got out that I was helping Alliance at the end of my reputation. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cheat. Here, attack that. Come on. This guy's got an eagle head. Okay. They don't care about the bull statue. Oh, God. What? Somebody rang the gong for the first time and threw the count off. Great. He lightning. Beer. Fire. Lightning. There we go. Dead. Man. Uh, I did we fight all of them? I think I fought all of them. I will help the priest. Come here. Help me kill this thing. Have a trip. No. Bad firebomb. Oh, yeah, I forgot I have a taunt. Yes, I'm helping. Just, I'm being nice. Yep, your totem's taking damage, dude. No, no lava burst. Um, fear, fire, stagger, stagger. 
There we go. I don't know if they're done or not. Nope, they have one more. Here we go. Oh. And they're dead. Are you done? They're done. Okay. Um, boss that I have no quest for. Yep. Okay. Shortcut down. Go to the innkeeper. Only the finest goods. Everything Which sell a whole bunch of crap. Oh, wait a minute. For a price. Um. Bow. Wand. Browsing yep. my competitors. You'll be back. Speak your business. Great, Sandy Cloak. Oh gosh, 29%. 28%. This is good, but not great. This is good. It's a lower item level, and it's got a, a set effect that doesn't even have an ability. I mean, doesn't even have effect here. And okay, I'm going to replace that. I one. serve the Zandalari. Okay, so now I need to go over here and I need to go to Brewmaster. Well, yep. Just to mix things up. Bing! Let's do that. Windwalker. Save. Yes. Hey, problem solved. Rabble. Um. And not heard. Oh, the Gaz Gazragon, the Hydra. I forgot to point it out. It says Gazragon, and then in brackets underneath it, it says Child of Gazrilla. Like, Godzilla. I, I think it's funny. Anyway. Tongues of Gazragon. There you go. There's the other one. Deliver Zolani's report to Habutu at the Golden Throne. Yes, yes. So Would perhaps we have a teensy bit of a problem down here. It is nothing we need to bother the king with. I will inform Zul. He will decide whether it is worthy of Rasta Khan's attention. No, you won't. You're going to block me. King's a really nice guy. I like him. He gave me a house. So I'm going to be nice to him. Dum -dum. Let's go back up to the. Yep, back up to the throne room. Place is absolutely gorgeous. I want to do some. Uh, you know that long intro that I have, that I did of some of the prettier places in Guild Wars Two. I want to do the same thing, but stuff here. Uh, I think it could look really cool. Wait a minute. Nope. I missed my stop. Here we go. A lot of stairs in this place. Oh, my God. Zaldazar, the city of stairs. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, statue to something, an idol. It's 
That's probably what that is, too, I think. Oh, those are drums, I think. Yeah, it looks like drums, war drums. Cool. So, Trunks, what class are you playing predominantly nowadays? If you are still here. Oh, awesome. It's a war trike. Oh, my God. So, I guess you sit up here. Line breaker, Wolko. Wow. Yes. I think it's interesting. They have a thing that covers the eyes. Hmm. <laughs> you just teach it to just charge in a straight line, I guess. Going up. I'm always curious what classes people are playing, which ones are more popular and less popular. Um, I seem to recall, these guys are cool, Royal Guardians, that I've been seeing more Shadow Priests now than I used to when I played last, but big doors. I wonder if this becomes something. I don't know. Okay, we got to go in here. This is the Great Seal. This is where we've set up the Horde headquarters. I'm going to go over here and use an elevator. Wait a minute. Nope, let's not get squished. Panda paste. Be a horrible thing. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I'm always curious who's playing what classes and whatnot. Um, um, Zolani speaks highly of your deeds, perhaps. We may not need to kill you yet. Thanks, Abutu. Rastakhan, very prompt. Now I have need of your hands. My prop... My prophet is a loyal servant, but he has his own ideas of how things must be. I'm sending him to tell Garub to deal with a mess of his own making. One of his pupils, a witch doctor by the name of Oljamba, has taken the Garubashi enclave as his own and ousted my guards. Ugh. Meet Zal at Talgarub and ensure his nuisance is dealt with. Do not let him get distracted. Zandala forever. That sounds bad. You made this mess, my prophet. Now go clean it up. Zal. As you will it, it will be so. Only I have foreseen that Voljamba will not die by my hand. Then take our new speaker with you and be done with it. He's gonna make me ah, do it. Ah, yes. They have proven themselves useful. <laughs> Thank you, Zal. I like his armor. His armor looks dope. You get to live, exactly. Habutu is not gonna kill me. I have no time for nonsense. Um You there, speaker of the horde. My spies have told me of dark heresies being practiced in our sacred temple sacred temple of Zanchul. The king sent Loti and Rawl to deal with the situation, but those two bickering council members are soft on their follower, they're their own followers. We need someone more ruthlessly neutral. Dibs! Uh, go meet War Druid Loti. War Druid? Okay. At the local... Uh, oh, at, uh, at the Zocalo. And she can tell you the rest. Okay. So we're going to step out here real quick. The quest down below me... Oh, I know. Let's pull out a different ride. The rocket. I like this thing. Whoops. Oh, yeah. I have to go in here. I think. Elevator. Let's go downstairs. There's a quest here. They say you have the air of the, the missing handler. You presume to speak for King Rostikon. Get in line. There are only 432 citizens ahead of you. <laughs> okay, to speak with. Um, I just received word from Warbeast Crawl that one of their handlers is missing. This is not usually a problem, but they're expecting a large hatching this year. Oh, 
Hatching of the War Beasts. Oh, woo. That's like a lot of Triceratops. Um, they will need all the hands they can get. Go on and see if you can find the handler. Name of Bazo or something and tell him to get back to the crawl. Baz Koji near War Beast Crawl. Okay. Forever. Think I know where that is? Uh, we. The city is confusing. It is very confusing. Yeah. Whoosh. Let's see if I can use. Nope. Crap. Oh well. Uh, okay, I need to... East or north? I'm actually gonna go east. Which means these people can't help me. Actually, I probably can't help myself, but whatever, that's not the point. Uh-huh. Gonna go down here. This is where I wish I was on my druid. I would just go into Boomkin form. I'd go into my owlbear form, and they can flap to slow fall, and I just jump straight off it. I kept doing that yesterday. It was a blast. Um, yeah, what class are you playing, Trunks? Like, the most. What are you playing right now? If you had to pick something. I've been splitting my time primarily between this character and my druid. Um, I do have a Death Knight... And a warlock I've been pe pecking at, though. I need to get the other artifacts for my warlock. He's still doing legion stuff. Hey, Vagrum, you want some rain? I'll try and box up the storm that's headed this way. So I ain't got to deal with it. Sure, man. If you can get it and put it in like a really big mason jar, that would be awesome. Okay. Yep, I'm going to do something incredibly dumb. Goblin glider kits. Um, okay. What is this? Oh. And woo! These things cost like twenty-five gold each. They're not cheap, but whatever. Discovered the slow. Hey, look! I'm on the ground. Isn't that useful? A oh, warlock. So your my your primary uh, was my original primary, uh, my undead warlock. Are you alliance or horde? I do have a demon hunter, mage, warrior, monk at one ten, and a rogue, druid, and hunter in mid one hundreds. But I've not touched those since BFA launch. Okay, wait a minute. There's a dead dude here. Up, oh, hunter Baz Koji, found him. Oh, wait a minute. Direhorn hatchling. Find someone at Warby's Crawl who cares for the young Direhorn. Oh, he's adorable. I've got a little trike. Horde, my lock is Nightborn. Oh, you unlocked some of the new races, did you? I'm, I'm like... With this character, I think it is. Yeah, see, I'm honored with High Mountain. The, uh, the, the Moose Torrin. But I'm not exalted, and you have to be exalted and finish a quest line. And I, I don't have any of the new races at exalted, so I haven't unlocked any of the new stuff. Um, I wanted to really make a high mountain druid. The druid that I made, I boosted, and I wanted to make him a high mountain druid. But as soon as I saw that you had to unlock and do a whole bunch of legion grinding that I hadn't done, I got demotivated really quick. Um, I still want to do it, though. I have the original four allied races unlocked. Are there supposed to be new ones added? I keep hearing people talking about that other ones would be added in the coming weeks, but I, I didn't think that was a thing. Okay, new flight path I need to unlock. Thank you. I'm going to go over here and see if this guy wants this thing. Are you the Hordeman I have been hearing so much about? I expected you to be a bit larger. Rude. Handler, um, Baz Koji was a real gift with the little ones. 
If this hatchling is following you, it must mean Bosgoji is dead. I don't have time to find another handler. Are you up to the task? Oh, God. Um, it's a lot of work, and the little ones get attached real fast. If you're going to care for it, it will be a commitment. That baby will be depending upon you. I hope you will be up to the task. First things first, there's plenty of fodder in the pens and river below. Feed the hatchling. Oh, God. It will be dead in days. Kill nine ravenous dimetrodons? Um. Whoa. Your spells and abilities have a grant to, chance to grant you 211 haste for eight seconds? Woo. Or upgraded boots, which I probably need worse. Eh. Um, okay. Kill nine Demetrodons. Sure. A oh, leather working supplies. Ooh. I'm actually going to. Yep. Give thanks to the Let's lower of shapes. Sell off with this. That's an old thing I need to keep. what over you. Um, okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm a little confused by this trunks. Maybe you can answer this. Uh, <laughs> um yeah, I have the original four allied races working on Maghar Orc still. Ah, cool. Uh, yeah, the wife says, "Well, I never. How rude!" Exactly. Telling somebody, "I thought you'd be. I thought you'd be bigger." It's not nice. Um, okay, Blizzard said they'll be adding new allied races throughout the expansion, but aside from the Maghar Orcs and the Zandalari Trolls for the Horde, they've not announced anything else. Interesting. I was kind of curious. I, it seemed to me like there was more Horde than there was Alliance, but you go to the character screen and it doesn't look that way. Oh. Um. Okay, Trunks, maybe you can answer a question for me. If you look at the tooltip on this artifact, right? Um, it says, Fist of the Heavens, artifact, and then it says Alberk and uh, Alred. I'm assuming these are the names of the items, but they used to not be there before. Is that a new thing, or am I just not remembering right? Because there's a lot of items now that I have. Nope. It will have under that like artifact line or weapon type line, whatever, you know, uncommon, rare, epic. It'll have a thing, an extra line there describing some weird, you know, beast slayer. So, okay, I need to go feed the, let's get a look at this thing. Hello. It's actually kind of, hey, adorable. Okay, and you're antsy. Apparently you're hungry. Let's go down here. I'm now in Windwalker mode, which basically means uh, high-powered DPS. I'm punching things to kill them quicker. Okay, I'm seeing some bushes that apparently I need to feed it. That is a crested Gekota. Interesting. Uh, wow, okay. What is that? Scary noises out here. That must be a thing they strap to it, I guess. I don't know. I'm only terrified. But they're not hostile, so... Mm. Neutral, neutral. A little stompy. Not very little. Let's find some more bushes. Oh, God. Are these dino eggs? The baskets remind me of Pandaren baskets. Nah. Lots of skip. Oh, that lady fed that thing. Look. She is actually feeding it. That is hilarious. Okay. Here's a Dimetrodon. Watch this. Okay, I'm, I'm trying not to aggro everything. Remember, 
how I get health back on this build. I'm a little puzzle on, fuzzy on that one. Oh, so much stuff to skin. That's going to be awesome. More leather! Okay, let's go back here for just a second. I need to refresh my brain because I've been playing Druid. Spiritual focus every time. No. 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 Right. So Tiger Palm, which is my number one, also applies nature damage to them and healing to me. Um... Reduces cool. This whole line is just useless. Um, increases your max chi by one. Um, this is damage mitigation. It reflects damage back at the bad guys. I actually should use that a lot more. One and a half minute cooldown. That's why. Inner strength. I actually can't remember, so I'm going to. Oh, I remember what it is. I think I remember now. Hang on a sec. We'll go fight something and see. Basically, you uh, get low on health, but when you kill something, you get the same kind of chi that the uh, brewmasters get during the fight. You get it from the kill after the fight, and basically, you pick it up then, I think. I'm a little fuzzy on the details. Need some kick. Kung Fu punches. And we pick up a Chi thing. Yep. But I think for the sake of durability. Nope. I'm gonna go back to Brewmaster. I think Brewmaster is just gonna be easier and safer. Much more durable as a Brewmaster. Okay. Did we get the plant? No, we didn't. Sweep. I need to target something. Oh, first. it's dead. Those are the irritable Dimetrodons, apparently. I see what they're talking about. Uh, okay, more feeding. 36%. 48%. Hey, okay. I'm gonna go around here and deal with more Demetrodons, apparently. Hello? Oh, I see some. Oh, God. I see a big thing in the background. Pinky! Hostile! Ooh. That seems bad. Wake up. I do not have a target. Okay. Lots of leather. I'm looking for some more of these bushes. See one over here. Oop, I see one back here. Hooray! Come on, Darhorn. Little Babby. I am out of rage. Oop. A lot of meat. Well, that reminds me. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Enchanted butchery. Yep, okay, it's still there. I have this enchantment I put on my shoulders that gets me more meat for my cooking when I kill stuff. 
I need to get closer. Too far away. I'm mitigating a lot of damage, apparently. I'm actually not having to drink quite as much as I normally would. Um, my ability to buffer damage is impeding on my alcoholism, apparently. It was a joke. Like, I, I'm buffering a lot of damage. But um, that's all the Metronons. I need more bushes, bushes. Stay away from there. That's a giant angry thing. Okay, like one more maybe. I am out of range. Bushes, exactly. I need more bushes. Uh, there's a bird. They can fly here already? Oh my god. I think it relies on Legion flying, and I still need to do that. I have not unlocked that. It takes like a quest or something. 96%. This should be the last one. It looks like there's something behind that waterfall, but that pinky thing is right there, so I'm not going back there. Hello, angry Demetrodon. Awesome! Okay. No, can't fly. That mount just has a ground. It doesn't have... Oh! So it is hovering at a locked distance above the ground. Right. Kind of like my rocket. Nope. Don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. Go over here. Wow! These are pretty. That's a juvenile dire horn. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, my God. Old... Yeah! Okay. I'm running. What the hell happened? I got a speed buff from somewhere. It was mildly terrifying. Okay. Now we're going to go over here and turn this stuff in. Anything, Junior? Dyorn Daycare. Okay. Um, I actually think I'm going to go with the boots. Assist your hatchling in fighting 12 creatures. Uh, whoops, wrong button. Uh, I'm going to do that and then update my uh, brewmaster set real quick. Time is money, friend. Collect 10 steaming fresh carrion. Right back. Uh, gross. That is a disgusting... Image. Got some coin to spend? Um, uh, I don't need any of that right now. I don't can afford another bubble or two. I wonder if we can do leather working here. Can I? What is something is bugged? Uh, okay. I will investigate later. Okay, so now... Just a little ways this direction. Old Direhorn gives you a speed buff periodically. Is that what that is? Terrified me. It seems kind of random. Oh, quests. More quests. It is too far away. 
Suggested players three. Oh dear. Okay. I'll I'll hold off on that one. Hello, Thunder Windrider. Will endure. So you're the one who inherited Be uh, Bazkoji's herd. What is left of it anyway? I know what killed him, and I warn tried to warn him. Queen Feather is a vicious rabbisaur, bigger than the rest and smarter as well. Most of the eggs around here are hers. Usually, I praise the strength of such a beast, but she has become a nuisance. Slay Queen Feather. Okay. Woo. Okay, I'm off-roading over here. Oh. Invasive Egg Snatcher. Hey, guess what? Out of range. I'm going to pick on you. Oh, that makes it charge, I think. Um... Whoops, closer. dead. Yeah, a 1 out of 12 hatchling commanded to fight. Headbutting 101. <laughs> okay, so if we do... Get their attention real quick. Switch over here. Do some of that, do some of that. Got some drinks. Both died at the same time. Okay. That's super weird. Okay, let's go over here. So one thing I get tired of really, really quick in an MMO, any MMO, World of Warcraft, City of Heroes, whatever, any MMO, one thing I get tired of really, really quick is when you feel like you're doing the same quest over and over. Like, yes, when it comes down to an MMO, you're either getting something or killing something, sometimes both in the same quest, but there are ways that they can disguise, dis disguise that function and the better the MMO, the more well-disguised those dynamics are. Um, let's go over here. Um, see, there's a big splash range on that. But sweep. Why don't you charge that one as well? I need a tug. And they're both dead. Dum -dum -dum. Four out of twelve charges. I could probably send them in more mid fight, but eh. Let's go over here. There's one by itself that we can pick on. Punching it to death. Nice headbutt. Put this thing off guard. Probably didn't need to do that. I need to target something first. Dun -dun -dun. Okay, the egg snatchers I can kind of ignore. Um, let's go over here. This. 
back up so we can include little nasty things. Okay, awesome. So do we get to keep this dire horn or no? Does it go back to the city? Um Ugh. Steaming fresh carrion. Yay. There we go. And both die at the same time. I don't know how I do that. It keeps happening, though. Super weird. I hope you get to keep it. It's cute. Or at least come back and visit it or something. I think that could be neat. You know? to sit down and figure out what I can do with all this new leather. Okay, it's charged up. I still need some more carrion, though. It is too far oh, away. that's Queen Feather. Hello. Okay, let's buff up. Ta -da. Buff her out some damage. Toss some alcohol. Light set alcohol on fire. Yeah, she's basically just a lot of hit points. What are you doing? Trip. It's gonna do that. I need a hug. There we go. Okay, Queen Feather is dead. I need. I need to get closer. Oh, I have a quest for leather. Purified fiendish uh, something else, come on. Stop tracking that one. Dum -dum. There's a lot of bullet sponges this time around, unfortunately. Yeah, it's it doesn't seem too bad. I mean I notice it. There are some that take take longer. To be sure. I need one more carrion. I am out and of yours is gonna have to do. There's the last of what we need. Dun dun. dun. Now, whoop! Queen feathers up again. Can we? Okay. It is too far away. Yeah, we're just gonna have to fight our way out. 
Splish splash. Oh. But it says a tiny thing nibbling on my ankles. Um, so much leather. How much leather? That much leather? Okay. Now I'm going to see if I can just kind of ride out of here. How do I get out of this place? Good green. Nope. Yep. All terrain turtle. There we go. There's angry Dimetrodon, so we must be going the right place. Oh, wait a minute. No, it's this way. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Okay, this guy was Queen Feather, if I remember right. Speak your business. Yep, Queen Feather's room, uh, plume. I'm gonna say Queen Feather's room. There we go. Get some reward for that. Go over here. And um, I think it's up here. Okay. Steaming fresh carrion. Listen, Big Arm, I need one more thing to finish making this supplement of mine. Dire horn growth hormone. Can't exactly be made without, you know, actual dire horn. But I've floated the idea of harvesting a few of their beasts, and all of a sudden I got a bunch of spears pointed at me. So I came up with another plan. These flying beasts eat dire horns, right? The big green flappy ones. I'm sure you've seen a lot of them. You find all the dire horn bits I need. Oh, partially digested dire horn Brody! Don't quit parking your giant thing on yak on top of me. Um, eight nearly hatched pteranodon eggs. Oh, so I'm going to the same place. Okay, and the dire horn stays here. Good. We need to go this direction. And I need to go up towards where the Flappy Beast things are. Whee! Let's go up here and see what kind of trouble we can cause. Is that a map thing? No, it's just a... Whatever. Okay. Jabra can the poacher. Okay. Here we go. I'll show you what the comic comic noises are in just a minute. Teradax Teradax Shredder. Stop screaming at me. Rude. And more leather. It's going to be awesome. Uh, okay, spiders. Oh, God. Okay, fine. I do not have a target. Okay, good. I squished the spider. Now we're going to get two at once. Oh. 
Didn't need to do that spin, but whatever. It looked fleshy. Okay, dire horn, partially digested dire horn flesh. This is gross. Uh, I have one of eight. Good grief. Come on, you dumb spider. Thank you. Okay. Here's another Pterodax Sky Shredder. Mistime that. Oop, gotta skin it. Okay, so there should be nearly hatched. That's going with me. Um, nearly hatched. Let's do spider. There we go. Good spider, have a drink. Here's three eggs. Uh oh, there's more over there. Oh my god, bramble wing. I'm probably gonna come back with that thing. Oh, can I get the You come in. Partially digested. Excuse me, kitty kitties. I am out of rage. I, I don't need to mess with you. You are not a threat to me. I did just kill your mom. It's not the point, though. Okay, none here. Yep, you come here. Excuse me. Hi, kids. Oh, this one's got a spider in it. Any fighting spiders. Ah. I need to target something first. Blech, spiders. Uh, nearly hatched. Yeah, exactly. Woohoo, indeed. Thank you very much, Red Sharpie and Mr. Trunks. Um, you come down here. I'll zap you with my monk lightning. Need to be closer. That was a weird noise. Okay. Platinum deposit requires mining. Ooh. Okay, we're going to have to go back up here. Now, I want the big one. Come here. Sounds like they're belching. Whoa. 
Hey, Trunks, do you know if there's any talents added after this? After 100, like, is there a 105 or a 110 talent? Or did they not change that? Uh, where is the parent? That's the parent? Sorry, I gotta wake you up. Whoops! Okay. I didn't need to aggro any of the kids. I'm sorry. It sounds like the belch when they die. No new talent tears. Eh, it's fine. Okay, I need more dire horn. That looks like a fish. What? Get away from me. I need a target. Okay. You get war mode talents instead. Yeah, war mode requires me being like in PvP something something mode. I will mess with it when I get some better gear, but I don't want to mess with it right now. Um, wake up! No. Got it that time! Snuff the screeching howl. Nice! Yeah, some of the war mode talents for warlocks, like demonology warlocks, look crazy. Oh, hi. I do not have a target. I need to work on my warlock some. He's still back in Legion, like level 102. And he's still getting his artifacts and stuff like that. Um, I have a demon hunter. I'm not going to mess with that thing right now. I'll come back to it later. Actually, I'm curious. Maybe it's guarding something. It's just a rare. Uh, hey, you. Sith lightning or something. Big melee range. Ooh. See one of those. Yeah, it's just got a lot of hit points. Oh, I should have done that backwards. Oh, I'm sorry, what? Okay, fine. Look, you. Come over here. I snuff it? I stopped it mid midway through the buffet. Ooh. I'm getting slightly better at talent. At, uh, Oh, Azure. Okay, so it gave me uh, artifact power. That's awesome. It had treasure inside of it. Um, 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 I haven't looked at war mode talents for monks. Maybe I should do that. Like, have you been going around in war mode or what? Too far. I I'm curious to hear about your experiences. I could step in voice if you want me to. There we go. Last of the flesh that I need. I still need something else. Oh, yeah. I need one more egg. And I'm just going to sneak right over here and get it. Boop. Got it. 
Now let's get a ride that at least seems like it's maybe fast. Excuse me. Coming through. Whoops. This is the area that I'm supposed to fix with Zul the Prophet. I'm not going to handle that yet. Excuse me. I will come back to this. I leveled from 110 to 120 in war mode. I didn't encounter any issues, to be honest. Never got ganked. Barely saw Lions players till I went across to Kul Tiras. That's a good point. Maybe I'll go back and switch into war mode with this guy. I don't know. Nope, I need to turn this in. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I'm paying attention. Even when I was there, they never bothered me unless I started something, which I haven't to date. Oh. Huh. I'm curious. Hot Trub. Purifying Brew is 30% of your purified stagger damage to all enemies. Ooh. That's evil. Within 10 yards. So when I purify damage, it washes it out to all the nearby baddies. That has potential. Double barrel. Your next keg smash. Oh, it's an instant. Eh. Mighty ox kick. You perform a mighty ox kick. Throwing your enemy a distance behind you. Uh, okay, let's do this in a minute. It's up here, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Eerie Fermentation, passive. You gain up 30% movement speed and 50% magical damage reduction based upon your current levels of stagger. Okay. Admonishment replaces Provoke. That's my taunt. Intimidates the target, increasing their damage taken by 3% for six, sec six seconds. Each unique player that attacks the target increases the damage taken. That seems evil. We zows, uh, essence. Drinking a purifying beer will dispel all snare effects. Drinking a purifying beer will dispel all, what? Snare effects on you, fast feet. All snares affecting you. Oh, there we go. Okay, reduce the duration of snares by 20%. You move. Okay, I think all the classes have an equivalent to that. Eminence reduces the duration of snares by 20%. Oh, there it is. Reduces the cooldown of transcendence transfer by five seconds. That seems like nothing because it's 45 seconds. Uh, uh. Increases the radius and damage of Breath of Fire by, it's my number four, by 100%, uh, causing it to disorient all targets it strikes for four seconds. Oh, that's nice. But its cooldown is increased by 100%. Ouch. That is 30 seconds cooldown. Mm. Nimble Brew. To share with allies, maximum of two can be carried at once. Removes all root stun, fear, and horror effects. And reduces... The, wow. So I can just hand these out. Avert harm. Cause uh, the guard... the four, Guard the four closest players within 15 yards for 15 seconds. Allowing you to stagger 20% of the damage they would take. By the way, there's a gem that gives an additional 5% experience earned. If you have something with a gem slot, it's worth getting one of those and just keeping that piece of gear till 120. Interesting. I didn't know that. You might have to tell me the name of that gem later. Because uh, I don't know that kind of stuff. I could look it up on wowhead, I guess, dot com. Um, cooldown of Zen Meditation is reduced by 75% while active. All harmful effects cast against your allies within 40 yards are redirected to you. Zimitation is no longer canceled when being struck by melee. Wow, okay. Right now, I have this thing called Zen Meditation. Reduces all damage taken by 60% for 8 seconds. Moving, being hit by melee attack, or taking another action will cancel the effect. So I think it's meant to be like boss attack. Like, you know, when a boss, boss is going to breathe fire or rain down poison or whatever. You hit that real quick. And it mitigates all the damage from that. This makes it so that it's no longer canceled being struck by melee. 
And when you turn it on, all harmful spells that would be cast against your allies in the four yards are redirected to you. Oh, that seems harsh. Yee. Okay. Wow. Tyrannodon egg. There we go. Partially digested dire horn flesh. Look. Okay, feed the dire horn growth hormone to your hatchling. This is probably going to last thing I'm doing here. Um, okay, so we target this thing. Feeding it. Ah! Okay. Ooh! It is a... Wow. It's still following me. Direhorn Juvenile now. Wow, this thing's awesome. It's probably going to go away Ow. soon, though. Keep it real. Complete. Uh, talk to Crawlmaster Bacor and choose to train your Direhorn. Okay. Um, this guy's down here, I think. Come on, Horny. A horner? I don't know. Bye, Sharpie! Time for me to go home. Thanks for seeing. Looks like fun. Thank you, Sharpie. Where is... Okay. Trunks has come online. Um, how to train your tire horn. I'm ready to train. Oh, God. Uh, oh, splintering charge. Oh, okay. I guess you can walk over that and get a heal. Ooh, clomp, clomp, clomp. Pinky! He sparred with a devil sore. He doesn't bite hard most of the time. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Let's go over that. I'm um, going around here, apparently. No, leave me alone. Throw a toy to distract Pinky. That's super weird. Okay, I need to hit some of these herbs to heal up. Throw a toy out. Charge the barrier to break it. There we go. Toss out another toy to distract him. Gotta get my heroes fixed. <laughs> uh, I think I've gotten poor Trunks addicted to Heroes of the Storm. It's a fun game, though. Let's grab some of that. It almost didn't break. Throw a toy out over my shoulder. You can see me throwing a teddy bear. Run for help! Over here, says the... Okay. Uh, okay. Here, Pinky, I have a nice treat for you. Oh, that is terrifying. Okay. Thanks. I'm gonna hop off. That'll be a little bit easier. What is your business here? Complete. What do you ask of desire? Help the handlers man? subdue Pinky. I am sworn to Okay. Now we get to fight Pinky. Oh, Pinky. Didn't regret this, but I taunted a devil sword. Spin kick. Come on, Pinky. Oh, so you get so many hit points. Don't attack the dire horn, attack me. I 
need so much hit points. I'm not taking much in the terms of damage, though. Oh, they got it. Bye, Pinky. Whee. Okay, that was trippy. Junkrat is on free rotation this week. Yes, I know what I'm playing tonight. Do you need protection? Oh. I had to go back up. Oh, back up here. Okay. 214 to 1. Oh, both of these are just abysmal, but... That is a bigger upgrade. Stable your dire horn in the beast pen. Ah, oh, well. Let's go over here and put Pinky away for a while. Maybe we can come back and visit. Or Junior, whatever it is. Pinky was the big uh, the big dino. Okay, Junior, come on. I actually can't go in there. Why, Junior? I will come back and visit. There we go. They'll take better care of them than I can. There we go. I think I'm done here. I'm actually... I'm going to come in here. I'm going to sit down. Kerplunk, kerplunk. I need to look at the war mode thing, apparently. Because you're right. Down here where I am in, in Zandalar, uh, next to uh, whatever it is. Yeah, Dazara Lord. The city, the capital city. Um, Down here, there's no... There's no alliance. I don't know. It's weird. I hadn't thought about that. I am kind of curious what it would be like in other parts of the map, though. No, no. We'll see. Um, I am actually going to call here. Thank you very, very much, everybody, for joining me. I appreciate it. Um, I will be live streaming again later tonight at 8 p.m. Texas time. We're going to be doing some uh, Here's the Storm. I greatly appreciate everybody coming by, hanging out with me, uh, and uh, just generally being... Uh, I will see you tonight, hopefully. If not, we'll have a good evening, and um, there will be Warframe on for tomorrow. I'm considering maybe doing an impromptu stream tomorrow afternoon with a little bit more WoW. Um, I have some alts that I have, an, I have a, like a, uh, I want to do a shaman and a couple of other characters that I want to actually make that I don't have characters for right now. Um, don't know. We'll see. Uh, but otherwise, I'll catch you folks later. Have a good one. Uh, let's see who is live streaming right now at this very, very moment. Do I know anybody that's live streaming? No, because Preacher is going to be streaming tonight. Oh, yeah. Ten, ten minutes more room world, says Dark Preacher. Let's see if he is. I'm actually going to go check. Um, come on. Load up. Yep, he is. Okay. Awesome. I'm going to send you folks over to the Delta Tones, Mr. Dark Preacher. He is playing some Rimworld. Go keep him company. I'll see you folks later. Bye-bye.